We're here in the live stream booth. We're going to talk about the HD 510. We're going to do that next. It's Geekazine's coverage of NAB 2014, and it's brought to you by our friends over at Otherworld Computing, celebrating 25 years. Hey everybody, Jeffrey Powers here with Geekazine.com and YouTube.com forward slash Geekazine. We're with, here with Laura from Livestream. How are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm doing, you have a nice, this is a nice fun NAB for you? Yes, it's been amazing. What, what, what'd you like the most so far? Oh, I don't know. Everybody here has been so friendly and really excited about our products, so yeah. it's been awesome. Now, you have, you have a great booth here. I mean, we have little race cars going over here and over here. and Everybody's playing with the live stream boxes and, and, and the camera mounted stream boxes and, and everything like that. It, it's, it's pretty amazing what you guys have done in the last few years. Of course, I've used live stream to get a lot of my shows out from time to time uh, with, with clients, especially that don't want to have advertisements on all of that. So you've got some great boxes and you've got a brand new box in, what, what's, the, what's the number of that again? Sure, it's the HD 510. It's a totally portable box and I'm really excited to show it to you. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna show you that box and we're gonna do that right now. All right, here we go. We've got the HD 510 right here. Laura, tell us a little bit about this. The HD 510 is actually a fully portable live stream solution. Um, it's one of the many devices that we have that are really great with, uh, you know, we have five inputs. You have HD SDI actually folds down so you can actually take it on the go, put it the top on it, and then put it in a carry bag. And the carry bag is... Uh... The carry bag comes with it. It's right here. You can see the HD 510 actually fitting in, and you'll see that we actually have two LTE devices. You can fit the LTE devices in the USB ports in the front of the device, creating your own bonding solution. They combine together to provide the full internet streaming capability for the device. So you're in the, in the middle of nowhere, you still can rely on live streaming. The screen is also, you know, you can fold the screen down, but it's also fully touch screen. Okay. You can choose all your different sources. You can do your inputs, your graphics. We also give you a keyboard and a mouse with the device. The keyboard obviously has the in and outs. It has the different color coding for the cutting and, and playing and program and preview. Um, it's worth $145. We get it for free. And then we also, in front of the device, um, have the control service. Okay. The control service is $6,000. It's a USB 2.0. Is that separate from that? It's separate, yes. Okay. So they're two, they're two different pieces of products that can work very well together. They're made to work together. This is made to work with the Livestream Studio software. Okay. It takes a USB 2.0, um, so it's like a regular keyboard. And then basically it's up to five different sources. We actually have add-ons in case you wanted to add more sources, but this is made to work with this particular device. All right. So what do we got, uh, what do we got for the buttons here really quick? All right, so we have a program in preview. Obviously, you can switch around. You can do your graphic overlays. You have your audio mixing. It's embedded audio along with the program. Um, and then you also have your, um, you can run advertisements here with the enterprise, enterprise uh, plan from Livestream. You can actually switch advertisements. It'll run the pre-roll right here via Google DFP integration. You can also see your audio monitors. You can manage your Twitter feed. We have Twitter social integration. Um, and you can layer that over each you other. You can layer everything over each other, yes. Of course, if it wasn't for our sponsor, we would not be at NAB and you wouldn't be catching some of this action. OWC, you know, they have some great memory for you. They got SSD drives for you. They've got a more enterprise solution in their Jupiter line. They've got a lot of great stuff. Memory that's made here in the United States, memory that you can put into your Apple, so you can put in your PC, you can put SSD. You could put an SSD into your Pentium 1 computer using the IDE tr uh, transfer cable. And they've got little adapters that'll do that for you. Lots of cool ways to make your computer have a longer life. Make your computer work a little bit more and save your PC, save your Mac. We have the hashtag, save my Mac. Tell me how you're putting memory from OWC into your MacBook. Maybe your 2007 MacBook, you just put on some Mavericks or something like that. Or maybe you just got the brand new Mac Pro and you wanna add more memory but don't wanna pay Apple prices. They've got solutions at a fraction of the price. You can check that out over at geekazine.com forward slash OWC. Geekazine.com forward slash OWC for some great ways. And then use that hashtag, save my Mac. To, uh, to tell me how you save money and memory on your Mac. Let's, let's talk a little bit about the inputs on the, on the live stream. What do, you, what do you got in back for connections? Sure, it's HDSDI. 
And we also have a version with HDMI. It's all Black Magic SDK. So as long as it's a Black Magic card, it's going to work with any studio product. We also have the product that you can purchase just via USB dongle. So you don't have to buy our hardware to use the product. You can actually download a free version, or you can have a premium version for $7.99 with up to five inputs. And then it's just a regular uh, PC box. Yeah, it's just running on Windows. As long as it's running on Windows, it's going to work fine with the software. Okay, so I could actually use the box for post-editing or anything like that? Yeah, definitely. I mean, we don't recommend running more than one thing at once, obviously. Yeah. But what's different that, about this box is that you can actually close it and use it. Like, you can open Chrome, you can open whatever. It's not a completely different housed software. What about if I wanted to use, like, a uh, uh, display a, a, a browser screen or something like that? OK, so there's no screen capture right now. But what you could do is you could actually upload either slides of that, or we actually have a remote camera option. So the remote camera, can you, you can actually screen capture your desktop and actually do the PowerPoint presentation, bring it in on the same network, and then switch it within your broadcast on the studio software. The remote camera apps are free. It works for iPhone, Android, iPad, Windows computer, and then we also have the Google Glass that we are so talked about earlier. Oh, yeah. All right, so that's the 510. Very, how, how heavy is it right now? It's actually really light. It's less than 20 pounds, and it comes with that carry-on bag, so you can put it in, in your overhead on a plane. There you go. If you got that live stream solution, here it is, the 510. All right, that was a that was a great box. I can't. I, I'm, I'm amazed at, at the functionality, the flip flipping down portability. Uh, I can see that being in my regular rig and go from there. Where what's the what's the price point on that box? Sure, it's nine 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 nine, and it actually comes with a free year of premium service on livestream.com. Okay, ninety nine ninety nine free year. Now, of course, you have uh, other other solutions for those people that don't have ten thousand dollars to spend on that. So. Of course, yeah, we actually have our livestream broadcaster, which is four hundred ninety five dollars. It's a single input with HDMI, and that, that'll get you going as well. Okay. Where do people go for more information? Livestream.com. There you go. Well, thank you very much, Laura, thank for your time. Very nice to meet you. All right, there you go. Check it all out over at Livestream.com. we got a lot more NAB action. Jeffrey Powers with Geekazine and the YouTube channel, YouTube.com forward slash Geekazine. Remember my hashtag, geek out.